Here's a cool ice peak, icebreaker keychain. There's a big keychain. There's a little icebreaker right here, and then it's untwists and flips over. Ooh, this comes off as well. Flips over and locks in this way. Spin it all the way, and then goes into here and spins to all the way here. Sweet. And now we have a little icebreaker, not super sharp, uh, but enough to break through the ice and so on, things like that. Very unique, like pocket tool right here, that's for sure. So, flips over, goes into here, spins in, and then covers back up. And also right here, a window breaker, in case stuck in a car, break through the window, boom. All knife, titanium hex bead driver, everyday carry tool. It's the same company as All Light. This one comes with uh, one of this lanyard. Cool. This one is anodized blue. There it is. Wow, that is beautiful. I like it way better than uh, like silver titanium. This one is a really cool EDC driver. There's a little like a door opens like this, and there's a ball. Pops in into here. It will scratch up a little bit, but it's nature of the locking mechanism. Boom. There's a four bits with a double tip on it. So we got eight different bits. So grab one of these, lock it in. Uh, sits in there really well. Put this ones back in, close it, use it. Uh, maybe different bit, smaller bit. Use it. Sits in there really well. Feels like a magnet in there or something. And then open the, this like door and then put them all away and there looks like a magnet inside there, let's see. Nope, no magnet, just sits there loose but it's not going to come off when we close that little door. Oh, looks like it goes into here too. Let's see. Take one out, put it back in. Um, put it two all the way. Now we have more leverage to unspin something, flip it over, go this way, boom. Very cool. I didn't even realize it was there. Yeah, that one is very nice. Multi-tool for sure. Paper towel holder, built-in bottle sprayer. Let's see what it's all about. So this is a full-on bottle sprayer that fits into the paper towel holder. That's cool. Super simple assembly. This will lock in into here with a couple of screws and spray bottle will go right inside of it. That is hilarious. So put whatever the G soap sprayer and so on into here and then paper towel on top of it all together. And there is a lock unlock. Very easy. So you need some cleaner next to paper towel. Perfect. Yeah, they're still making some cool kitchen gadgets for sure. We got knives, signature, there's only made a hundred of them. So this is a Zilkuti uh, insert right here. Handle and a titanium handle on the sides. It's a lock, it's a gravity knife. I love it. And what's so special about this one, look at that patterns. And none of them are the same patterns. That's beautiful. Okay, there's one more kind of like the dogger shape way better this one is like wavy this way just a little bit different wow I know how to choose and this one is a dagger style this one is Tanto and both of them are just insanely beautiful and only a hundred of them made what do you guys think that's definitely a nice collection pieces right here like America handle is more of like everyday use. This one would be a collector. Items, they'll go up to $450. And they go up in wallet, that's for sure. We had XO M. This one is a bit blasted Burl Line America. So very cool, like a signature uh, inserted here. It's like a camo. I got this one at a blade show, really hard to find. And I just love it. This is a medium uh, XO serial number 404 05 2023. 
what do you guys think it's a beautiful good looking dark camo with white kind of perfect for winter i guess with uh like a muddy snow and stuff and this is a uh, name of the model and the logo of a designer so beautiful and it has a lock to where it's not going to come off beautiful uh, it does have a little bit shakiness to it but it's just a nature of a uh, gravity knives they all have to go up and down freely so when it's locked it's going to have a little shake but if i hold it tight there's no wiggle just a little tiny but it doesn't bother me i love the design leatherman skillet tool so it's actually leatherman version of a folding knife very unique that's for sure so there's a bottle opener slide into the side interesting this way and there's a knife pretty cool what kind of steel do they use do they say not on a blade there's a lock right here very simple it says leatherman skeleton kbx i mean that's a perfect tiny little uh, pocket knife for everyday use because it's lightweight and very small curious what kind of steel they're using the materials are stainless steel so very low uh, grade materials but nevertheless it's made by leatherman at least it's built well so only $40 uh, folding knife it's cool to have very affordable and if you get that broken or lost no big deal it's under $50 knife so not super collectible I wish the steel was better but it is what it is thought I'd buy it and show it to you that leatherman folding knife there it is this is Demco knives custom knives shock lock AD20 let's open it up beautiful holster over here with a patch um, Demco shot lock and this is a custom it costed me two thousand dollars before you're going to say it was too expensive people buy them for four thousand dollars and they are incredibly hard to get like on eBay and such websites um, wow really soft the only way you can pretty much buy the custom ones are at the blade show and the way it works push and it not just pull back right here it uh, pulls up a little bit and then it pulls up a little bit and it's so smooth so first of all easy to close and open this way thumb stud incredibly smooth wow i should have got a couple of them i love this unatized i think titanium handle um and it looks like teeth that's why it's called shock lock wow beautiful and on the inside over here it says mega cut magna cut beautiful look how thick that blade is and it's not even that heavy um let's see perfectly balanced knife that's why i would hold it so it's just very comfortable to hold it it's not too heavy on the phone not too heavy in the back just perfectly level knife incredible so this makes a really nice collector knife but also i wouldn't be afraid using it because it is incredibly strong knife too it will last a lifetime